let's talk about C.J. Beathard because we'd written him off. Just as Nick Mullins is written off right now by everyone, C.J. Beathard was written off by everyone, including me, two years ago. Waited, 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 got a chance to play today, and what did he look like? Confident, healthy. We haven't seen confident C.J. since since he beat the Giants in 2017 here. Three years ago. Remember that long throw we made to Marquise Goodwin? It was beautiful. That's over. It's been over, and now it's back. So I think that was very encouraging that one of their backups played with, with confidence today. And what's interesting about C.J. Beathard is he may have the strongest arm of the Niners uh, wide uh, quarterbacks. He can sling it a little bit. He... He can throw the ball to the sideline. He has a deep pass. And the thing about him, I, I, was, ex- I was describing it during training camp, and I don't know if I describe it well, but he's, a, he's like a submarine quarterback. He throws with like a low three-quarter release that you could almost call sidearm. And I don't know where he gets that. Like Nick Mullins goes to Tom House so he can learn to throw with the most precise mechanics of all time. And C.J. Beathard's just like out in cornfields. Like, I don't know, maybe I should just bring it down a little bit. Maybe I should just wing it and it works for him so i gave cj bethard an a for his performance he must feel very confident it's like his career was on life support it's his career was in a coma and all of a sudden he's back he's talking he's singing in the er room he's dancing on his bed so good for you cj i love i love a story like nick mullins but i also love a story like cj bethard a guy who's been written off and taking criticism for years for freaking years and he takes it, and when he gets his opportunity, he makes something of it. Dante, I hope you're watching C.J. Beathard because that could be you. That could be you one day. Take heart in what C.J. did tonight. You may get an opportunity in a few weeks. If you step up, people will look at you differently. All that matters is what you've done recently. And C.J. Beathard, what he's done recently is play really well. He might have won this game if Kyle Shanahan hadn't called that onside kick.